Welcome to Joyo Share iOS Solutions YouTube channel. Over here, we'll share three methods to help you solve the iPhone passcode change itself. Some users complain that they always use a four digital passcode on their iPhones. All of a sudden it happens, the iPhone passcode changed itself to a six digital one. Why is the iPhone password changed itself? There are several reasons that cause the occurring of this issue. It can be roughly divided into three parts. The first reason is that there are some bugs with iPhone itself. The second one is the iPhone data corruption. And the last one is the new kind of security arrangement of Apple after an update. If you bump into this question, just try these solutions to resolve it. Let's go ahead and dive right in. The first suggested solution to the iPhone passcode randomly changed trouble is connecting to iTunes to restore it. This is the most commonly used method to unlock an iPhone without knowing the correct passcode. The operation procedures are pretty straightforward, launch iTunes on your computer and click the device icon after your device is detected. In the new window, you can find the storage information of your iPhone. You can back up your data to the computer before restoring your iPhone. Now go to click the restore button. You'll find a pop-up window that prompts you to back up your device to the computer. Simply click the don't back up to ignore it or select backup. Now click the restore and update button to confirm that you want to restore your iPhone iTunes will start downloading and installing the latest version of the iOS system to your iPhone. Proceed to click the Done button and wait for the restoring. Apart from iTunes, using iCloud is another official method to fix the iPhone passcode changed itself problem. When the Find My iPhone is turned on and your iPhone is connected to a Wi-Fi network, then go to Use Find My iPhone to bypass the changed passcode on your iPhone. Open a browser on your computer, iPad, or other devices to go to iCloud.com and then log into your iCloud by entering your Apple ID and password. After entering your account and password, you will receive a code to confirm that you want to log into iCloud. Then click the button to enter into iCloud. After that, select Find My and find your iPhone in all devices. Now choose Erase iPhone to remove the passcode from your iPhone. In case you are seeking a speedy solution, an iPhone passcode unlocker, Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker. Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker is a professional and powerful unlocker that can safely unlock various screen locks from iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker can quickly remove the screen passcode. Support multiple unlocking situations, remove the screen passcode in three easy steps, and quickly unlock all i devices without the passcode. Without any technical requirements, you are allowed to make the most of Joyo Share i Passcode Unlocker to crack and erase up to four kinds of iOS screen locks. With the exception of the widely used four digit and six digit passcodes, this password removal tool is also applicable to the intelligent face ID and touch ID. Also, you can use it to unlock your iPhone in different scenarios. Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker can easily bypass the iPhone passcode when you forget the passcode at a sudden moment or after a long time since setting it. Or you want to access a device with a second-hand iPhone or iPad. It can unlock your iPhone when you have no way to type in passcode due to a broken screen on your iPhone. You can use it to unlock your iPhone due to incorrect password entries many times. Meanwhile, you can use it to crack the Touch ID and remove the Face ID safely. With broad compatibility, Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker can be a competent helper for you to clear any ready passcode from a range of modules of iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. First, you need to use a USB cable to connect your iPhone to the computer. Then launch Joyo Share I Passcode Unlocker and it will detect your device, then click the Start button to begin. Once your iPhone is in recovery mode or DFU mode, you can check the device information and correct it if there is anything wrong. Afterward, click on the Download button to download and verify the firmware package. 
wait until the download is completed, and then you can click the unlock button to start unzipping the firmware package and unlocking your iPhone. Once it's done, you can get access to your iPhone again.